So I'm with a few of the members of the team from NC State. I was hoping you could tell me a little bit about your experience here. Uh, it was absolutely fantastic. It's uh, amazing to have all this hands-on experience with the cluster and being in this competition. And while we were able to work with the cluster and practice at our university, here we had a very collaborative experience with a lot of other universities and really appreciate that. It was exhausting, though. <laughs> Can you tell me about the uh, mystery application? It was based off the code they used to like, find a creation to go to Mars. And so they made a dumbed-down version for us. Um, and that was a not too difficult application, but it was GPU-based, which was really nice because a lot of the applications ended up not being GPU-based, and we had a very GPU-heavy system. Okay. But we got that up and running pretty quickly. I was wondering if you could tell me why you chose CentOS as your base operating system. It, the open source is important to us, and it was pretty stable. Uh, we wanted stability instead of you know, running into a lot of errors because some were something too cutting edge. And because we didn't have to deal with any licensing or anything like that, we could just kind of, you know, grab it, put it on our systems. And I had a bit of experience because I put it on a personal computer at home trying to play around with it All as right. well. If somebody from, say, another university were interested in, in doing something like this, what advice would you give them? Start early. Definitely start early. Make contact with vendors and get hardware as soon as possible so you can start practicing. <laughs> So we were really new to all this, and so we've learned a lot, but there's still a lot to go, and I feel you have to budget a lot of time for this as students, especially because you're taking a lot of other classes. Right. It, this takes a lot of time to learn because kind of we came into this, you know, taking a few programming courses and no bas basic Linux command line skills, and now suddenly we're thrown into these, this, yeah, a lot going on. But so start early, practice hard, Thank you for your time, and, and good luck when the results come out. I appreciate it. Nice talking to you.